the NFL owners tonight uh, approve the return of the Los Angeles Rams to the market, uh, starting with the 2016 season. The announcement marks the end of the NFL's 21-year absence from the nation's second-largest media market. The Rams were based in the L.A. area from 1946 until the end of the 1994 season. In 2019, they will uh, be opening in a new stadium, which uh, we are all, as ownership, uh, very excited about the kind of facility that's going to be built that we believe uh, will be uh, extraordinarily uh, successful in the Los Angeles market. The team will likely play in the Los Angeles Memorial Coliseum until the new stadium is ready in 2019. It's a difficult uh, market. It's a difficult place to uh, permit a stadium and build something that we as a league can all be proud of. Uh, I think we worked hard. We got a little bit lucky and we had a lot of good people help us. The San Diego Chargers have an option to share the facility. If they do not exercise that option, uh, the Raiders uh, would have the option also to move to Los Angeles or to move to Los Angeles with the Rams. The league will give $100 million to the Chargers and the Oakland Raiders if either team builds a new stadium in their current markets. The Chargers can continue to negotiate with San Diego for a new stadium deal while keeping the option of joining the Rams at the $1.8 billion complex that the Rams are building. I will be working over the next several weeks to explore these options that we have now created for ourselves to determine the best paths, path forward for the Chargers. The appetite for NFL football in the Los Angeles region remains questionable. Both the Rams and Raiders left the region in 1995 due to declining interest. No NFL franchise has moved since the Houston Oilers went to Tennessee in 1997.